Let's return to our NI example finder. We're going to enter the word mechanical into our search field. And the example we want is mechanical action of Booleans. Let's open this up. Run it. Let's observe the behavior in each of these. There are six different mechanical actions. Switch when pressed. Switch when released. Switch until released. Switch is the first category. The second category is latch. The same three choices are there. Latch when pressed, latch when released, and latch until released. Let's start with the switch when pressed. When we push this button, and when we release the mouse click, notice how the light turns on and the number begins counting. If we push the button again with our mouse, Immediately, it switches to the off position, the light turns off, and the number stops counting. Let's look at the latch when pressed action. When we push that, the LED turns yellow for one count, and the count increments by only one. If we push it again, we see, regardless of how long we hold that button down, the latch happens only once. This is equivalent to pushing a key briefly on your keyboard. If you push a key, for example the H key, you get the letter H, but you only get it once. However, when you push the caps lock key, the caps lock toggles and it stays down until you push it again. So a normal key is like a latch, and the caps lock key is like a switch. The difference between the first row, when pressed, and the second row, when released, is easy to see just by example. If we click on the switch, and we haven't let go of our mouse button yet, notice how the light has not turned on and the system has not started counting. As soon as I let go of my mouse button, then the switch happens. Similarly with the latch, if we push the button, not until we release the button does the system count. The other advantage of this method is if we were to push the button but not release the mouse button and then move the mouse off, we can release the mouse button without having triggered an event to happen. The third option is until released. I'm going to just toggle my switch back off again. Switch until released has the action of switching and counting while and only while the mouse button is down. As soon as I let go of the mouse button, then the switch is off. This is much like a pulsed mode, where we want an action to occur only while we're pushing the button. Latch is exactly the same. When we push and hold the latch button, the latching continues until we let go, and then the last one finishes. Let's stop the VI and very briefly look at the code. What's important to notice is that the code for all six of these buttons is exactly the same. We do not have to manage or take care or worry about handling the latching or the switching behavior on the block diagram. What we need to do is properly select the mechanical action on the front panel. We do that by right-clicking on the control, choosing mechanical action, and picking the right of the six options we've just described.